Before I go further with the Crusades, uh, let me just get ourselves oriented to the handout. Uh, the introduction to the Crusades as a topic is on 343, uh, the map on the next page, 344, uh, the causes of the crusading spirit. I think I've covered, but they're there on 334, 344, sorry. First and Second Crusades carry over to 345. Uh, Third and Fourth Crusades, as I say, and then the uh, Crusading Spirit dwindles. That's the last thing we'll read at the very bottom of page 345. Uh, the First Crusade was the only real successful uh, of the uh, Crusades. It succeeded in capturing Jerusalem, uh, which was followed by uh, a terrible atrocity uh, in the name of the church, the, the, the massacre of the population of Jerusalem, the, the map, the massacre of the Muslim and Jewish populations of the city of uh, Jerusalem uh, puts a, uh, a, a bloody cast on uh, the uh, Crusades. They were, uh, they were, they were very violent. It, it speaks to the depth of uh, medieval faith. Uh, and that's, that's uh, all I can say uh, uh, about it in uh, defense of uh, what happened. Uh, every other crusade uh, that went out, and there were, by some countings, five or six, seven different crusades, uh, were all primarily efforts to uh, reinforce or bail out the Christian states which were created in the Holy Land after the first uh, crusade, uh, and they were all uh, more or some were more or less successful, uh, but none were successful in establishing a permanent Christian kingdom or a series of smaller Christian states uh, in the in the Holy Land. And the spirit behind it all, uh, originally so uh, faith-based and pure and unselfish, uh, as as you get to the bottom of the page, you, you see the heading: the Crusading Spirit dwindles. Uh, the dwindling down of the uh, crusading spirit is a barometer for the uh, age of faith. As, as the spirit for crusade uh, lessened, uh, we, we feel that we're coming out of the age of faith uh, and into uh, yet another great historic period. But again, that took a long time, and we've got two or three other topics to uh, look at before we uh, draw the curtain over the Middle Ages and come on into the third of our great periods, early modern history. Uh, the assignment for next time uh, is, the, is the next handout, uh, which uh, you should have. Uh, England and France develop is the uh, lead title, and... Uh, It, the, the next section, uh, a century in turmoil, uh, and that goes three pages through uh, the uh, Hundred Years' War, uh, and we'll cover all of those pages uh, next class uh, on uh, Thursday. We're set. We're all done. Good deal.